made an excellent choice. More importantly, this is the last test for the year. And if SpongeBob does not pass this one, it means another whole year of boarding school! Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Cody. The guy you see on screen is Eli. And we asked you on our community poll if you wanted to see a top 10 vending machine collection video from our vending machine collections this year, and you voted yes. This is the last video of 2019, so we're really excited to share with you our top 10 vending collections from this year. So coming in at number 10 is our McGregor coin pusher from episode 30 that we had a, at a seafood restaurant before they sadly shut down. But guys, take a look at all of these quarters. Very nice. And I mean, this is number 10, so we've had quite a few uh, episodes before. This is episode 71. Uh, so we've had a lot of episodes so far this year. Let's dump these quarters in and see how she did. Looking good, looking sweet. All right, it made $195.50 from one month, which is a nice pull from this location. Coming in at number nine, we have our amazing seven foot tall gumball machine from episode 57. And a quick spoiler for the future guys, we're getting another seven foot gumball machine that's even bigger and badder that you guys won't believe it. It's so awesome. We can't wait uh, to show you guys in the next 30 days. But look at all of these gumballs. This is such a cool machine. This has gotta be my favorite machine out of every single one that we have. So let's turn on this scale and uh, pop this machine open and see what we have inside. I wonder how many of you guys already know. Um, I wouldn't blame you for not knowing because I actually had to go back and look at all of these numbers as well. Uh, so let's just get this coin mech out. And we're dropping quarters already. Looking sweet, looking good. And if you guys didn't, uh, didn't realize it, we just took out this little cup or whatever you wanna call it. So next time that we collect, that little blue collector will not be in the machine. So we hope that it'll collect even more. All right, here we go. 193.75 and quarters and three dollars in spare change for 196.75 for just two weeks absolutely crazy and for number eight we have our kitty crane machine out of many we have many kitty crane machines uh but this is at a mexican restaurant uh, that we've shown many times uh and we got of course our candy machine right next to it looking good looking sweet Look at all those ducks in there. Those do very well. So if you guys are interested, uh, maybe give those a shot. They do very well. And of course we had to doll it all up. We got the Pokemon cards in there. We got some small plush in there. We got these uh, troll somethings in there, whatever. It, it just looks so good, nice and full like that. So let's open her up, see what we got. We will, of course, start with the quarters. Guys, I can, it just feels so good coming back to these videos. Let's dump these quarters in. All right, 11050 in quarters. Looking good. Guys, this is episode eight. And that to me is just so crazy. It's so much fun just being able to look back and our video quality was just so much worse than it is now but still i mean let's open up this dollar bill acceptor and bang guys looky looky what we got here that's what i love to see this money uh it's well spent already but you know what it feels like i just opened up this machine or eli did rather we're looking at 227 dollars and 25 cents in just two weeks which was a lot for this spot uh so we were super psyched coming in at number seven we have our route 66 crane from 
smbsales.com from episode 68, which is pretty recent. Uh, we got it looking nice and full now. We got the frogs in there. We got the UFO heads looking good. The SpongeBob block plush, which is a really cool, unique kind of plush. I think it's, it's very cool. We will open up the crane. All right, and we will start with the quarters. All right, looking fat already. This crane has been shown many times as well, uh, but we will get the quarters out and then we will work towards the dollar bill acceptor and kind of just see how much cash. Oh my gosh, looking fat, looking good. I just love it. I absolutely love it. Pulling it out slow. Sweet. We're looking at $290.75 for this spot, which is a really, which is a really, really good pull for this spot. So we were really excited to get all of that. All right, coming in at number six, we're at a Silver Strike coin pusher. Uh, from uniquevending.com. This is a uh, like a golfing place. They got a driving range and they got miniature putt putt. It's a really cool place. Uh, but our coin pusher here is looking very good. All right. I, I completely forgot that uh, we got the towel down there. But guys, look at this pile of money looking really good. And actually, this towel is really effective for uh, collecting quarters. Um, it's like, I don't know, it's, it's, it looks a little, I don't know, not as, not as clean as like a, like a box or whatever, but let's dump these quarters in and see what we got. This is from episode 32. Wow. A ways away. We're looking at $295 flat, which is awesome. Just very, very awesome. And you guys know we love coin pushers absolutely love them all right coming in at number five we have one of our pirate chest cranes by smartind.com that stands for industry uh, from episode 60 our second most viewed video which is just crazy to me look at all of that plush in there looking good looking sweet that's the good stuff all right we're looking good looking thick let's dump these quarters into the pouch and it's filling it up pretty nicely we got some spillage there a little party foul awesome get those inside there let's open up the dba bang guys fat fat that's what i'm talking about very very nice we're looking at 339 dollars and 50 cents in one month which is nuts. We absolutely love this Mexican spot. We love all of our Mexican restaurant spots. They all do really well, but this one in particular just did really, really well that month. All right, guys, coming in at number four, we have two of our 24 inch wide carnival cranes also from smbsales.com. A very recent episode, uh, episode 68, these cranes killed it. Uh, so before I say anything, spoil it, let's open them up. All right, it did pretty well. The one closest to the inside, we're looking pretty good so far. Not bad at all. Dump all those quarters inside, looking good. All right, let's slide that drawer back inside and let's get to this cash money. Open up the DBA and boom, guys. Look at that. It's it's just a good feeling. I don't know, even just going back to old videos and just talking about past uh, collections we've had, it's, it, it just puts the same kind of smile on my face. I absolutely love it. We have to put that to the side. It will just completely fill up the pouch. So let's move on to the other one closest to the outside. And guys, not not as fat, but I you can't complain. You can't be mad at something like that. Looking really good we're looking at 393 dollars and 75 cents for the month just wow wow is all i can say it did absolutely phenomenal 
All right, guys, coming in at the number three spot, we have another Silver Strike coin pusher at our gas station location. I love this spot. You know, I always get calls from them that the change machine is empty, but you know what? That's a burden that I love to have. That means that they're using our machine. Let's open it up, see what we got inside. Take a look at that, guys. Oh yeah, those are hands of silver right there. That's what I love, guys. This is from episode 39. Very, very awesome. Let's dump this into the counter and see what we got here. Any guesses? Any guesses before we dump it in? All right, here we go. All right, it did a huge $443.50 for the month, which actually is the norm for this spot. So that's absolutely just nuts. I mean, these coin pushers just kill it. So coming in at number two, we have one of our favorite spots is an Asian buffet, a Chinese restaurant, if you will. Uh, this is way back from episode 16. Can you believe it? Um, it feels like we've come such a long way since then. Let's open up these machines and see what we got. Looking good, looking sweet. Oh, I even gave Eli a little bit of assist there. How about that? Man, I was a good guy back in episode 16. You guys like that little assist? How about it? <laughs> That's funny to me. Okay, let's slide the drawer back in. Dollar bill acceptor off. Oh my God. Look at that. Just so good. That's just so good. Eli's having problems taking it out because it's so much look at that look at him <laughs> so fat i love it i absolutely love it great pool just a phenomenal pool no room in the pouch he just sat it to the side let's open up this other one closest to the outside all right looking looking a little uh shallow on the quarters uh, but you know what i'm not too worried about that I, i've been here before i'm having a little bit of deja vu uh so we'll dump all of these quarters into the pouch get the get the ones that we're trying to escape and then we got the dba let's open her up smackaroos guys look at all of those smackaroos i love it just so good what a great pool what a great pool we're looking at 638 dollars for one month just mind-blowing just completely mind-blowing and i'm gonna go back and just watch that whole episode uh we got 194 dollars in quarters and then the rest so 638 uh all together and guys this is it the grand finale number one of course we have our grocery store location this just came out not too long ago but you guys you may not have seen the footage from the guys uh or one guy that broke into the store and attempted to break into this coin pusher way way back but that was just absolutely crazy and just look at all of these quarters just kind of sitting and we actually ran out of room for our AccuCount uh, scale so we just kind of dumped in what we could. Eli's doing handfuls, absolutely lovely. I'm just going to go ahead and tell you guys it made $1,210.25 for a YouTube record as far as we're concerned, okay? and. I mean, I think uh, Claw Kicker might have pulled something just as much or maybe a little bit more, but that was just so amazing to us. Um, but guys, that makes a total for this top 10 video a whopping $4,230. Absolutely crazy. Thank you guys so much for watching our videos this year, and we'll see you again real soon in 2020. Goodbye.